This is the 7th grade TCAP practice test math section. Question number 15. The question says a number cube with faces labeled 1 through 6 is rolled one time. Uh, what is the probability that either a 2 or 4 is rolled? Now the first thing you need to know is what a number cube is. A well, number cube is like a nice way of them saying the word die, which is the singular version of the word dice. So if you ever played with dice before, if you only have one of them, it's a die. I kind of drew a very bad drawing of one over here earlier. Uh, so it's that thing you roll that has six sides on it. Um, they can't say die or dice. I think that relates to gambling or something. I don't know. Anyway, uh, they say the faces are labeled one through six. So you've got one, two, three, four, five, six. I'm assuming they're the little dots, but it's possible they're numbers. Who knows? It doesn't matter. What is the probability that either a two or four is rolled? Now, in order for us to do probability, we need to make a ratio or a fraction even. Let's just refer to it as that. Why not? On the bottom of our fraction or ratio, we're going to put the total possibilities. On the top, we're going to put what's called preferred possibilities. Uh, really, what's easier for me to think about is um, what I want to happen versus what's possible to happen. Now. It's really simple here. The total uh, number of possibilities would be 6 because I can do 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I'll put that on the bottom. On top, what I'm going to do is put what I want to happen. And in our question, it says either a 2 or a 4 is rolled, which means it can either be the number 2, so right here, or the number 4. Now I need to count how many of those boxes that I just made, uh, or how many of those numbers I made boxes around. I have 1, 2. So I put that on top of my fraction. But there's no 2, 6 in the answer choices. Very simple. All I need to do is reduce the fraction. You can do that in your head. You can do that in your calculator. 2 goes into 6 three times. So reduced, this thing should be 1, 2 over 3 twos. So 1 third. So my answer to number 15 is just C. Now, not really that difficult to do. Just make sure you don't use that 2 or that 4 as anything other than a label. So if you write out this little section here, your life becomes much easier because you stop seeing the numbers as something you need to plug in. Instead, you see them as labels, which is what they should be used as. So I don't think it's really that complicated if you make a little drawing for yourself and kind of fun to write on the paper anyway. So good luck.